Hi, we're at IBC 2022 and I'm talking to Davide from Anfrodo. Hello, Hi Davide. All. Hi. And uh, you want to show us a little bit uh, about the new bags. They're not that new. We actually already reviewed some of them. And full disclosure, we're using them right now uh, to carry all our stuff in the show. But uh, let's talk a bit about them, the different versions that you have, and you have some hard cases as well. Yeah, so sure. Go on. Here we conceive the range of backpack basically to make the daily workflow fast and efficient, but what's more important, safety. So you can work worry-free basically. Uh, most important thing about uh, our backpacks is that basically, uh, you know that Manfrotto got tripods, uh, support, stabilizers, motion controls. And a lot more. <laughs> and a lot more. So our bags, the cool part about our bags is that they are scalable to all of our range of products. So depending on the style of the backpack, depending on the pockets, depending on the feature, all our backpack are capable of working with the full range of Manfrotto products. And that's what we call fluidly scaling. So basically because all of our pack, uh, backpacks, regardless of the style of the photographer rather than the, the, video, the videographer, is capable of working uh, seamlessly with all the gear needed for a shooting. So we got the flex loader, the back loader, and the multi loader. The names of the backpack are, uh, basically the backpacks are called after the way you can load the bag and the style of the bag. So for example, let's start from the smaller one that we have here, which is the back loader. The main feature of the back loader is that basically uh, this bag is loadable from the back part. So this is one of the most common style of uh, uh, type of load. Okay. Uh, the cool it's thing also is, protective because nobody can steal whatever exactly, you have. Exactly, exactly. It's one of the favorite style of backpack from professional because basically you got your gear accessible from the back, so no one can touch your your bag. Uh, as you can see, it's fully red. This is a new technology that we launched uh, in October with a new range of backpack. This is pretty nice and cool because basically it's called M Guard, and it features a new style of protection that allows you to go beyond just protection. Most of the camera uh, dividers, uh, well, protection most of the time is, is given as obvious or as, or as normal. So it's something you expect from a bag. Uh, but actually in our case, uh, our old system, the CPS, was pretty big to protect your camera. But the, the most important part of a bag is not just protection, but it's space. So basically, with this, this new technology, which is EVA, we were capable of thermoforming it to save a lot of space, up to 30% more space inside the, the camera compartment, uh, without compromising protection. So basically, you, you see that it's thinner compared to the previous one and allows the, the professional to store much more gear without uh, comp any compromise on protection. Okay, so this is the M guard. So you can see here the back loader is a style like this and you got here as well an organization of the internal compartment in order to gain space as well for your personal items. This bag is a multi-loader because you can load it from the top in case you want a fast access, for example, to a long lens camera. This bag is loadable from the front in case you want to have a, a super fast access to it and it's loadable as well from the side in case you want a fast access to the camera. It's usable not just as a backpack, but as well as a sling bag. So basically, it allows for an incredible versatility, and that's what we call scalability. So basically, it's scalable not just to the gear, but as well to the style of the photography, or to the needs of the photographer. So this is the biggest bag of the range. Normally, we suggest uh, this type of bag to creators, uh, for example, who uses a lot of gimbals, sliders, drones, and cameras with the, as well rig mounted. This bag is uh, 20 liters, but allows, due to the name Flex Loader, to gain extra space just using uh, the zipper here. Basically, you can gain four more centimeters of space, allowing the creator to use this extra space for a gimbal which can be stored here on the back rather than on shoe sides. So for example, in our case, with the Move ecosystem, uh, the, um, the professional is allowed to bring with him a gimbal, a modular gimbal, and all the accessories. So you got a full creation set inside the backpack. 
Okay, so you can bring your studio directly with you. You could also put a laptop in here as you well have, as the gimbal. Um, you can put a gimbal and you have as well a bag for your laptop. Yeah. Without that's, compromising that's extra space. In case you're a rig lover and you use a, a video camera, basically you can open the main compartment of the bag, you can expand the bag and you can move the main drawer downward to the bottom of the bag, gaining extra four centimeters of the bag. So you can put a camera with the rig mounted. So it means that you can bring with you a full video set. Okay, so this bag allows for incredible possibilities of loading. It's uh, also completely this, this, this completely whole completely removable. Yeah. So photo, video, drones, uh, uh, and the and full it, Manfrotto ecosystem. And it comes with this. Uh, it comes extra. with a pouch, uh, which is uh, perfect for extra accessories such as filters, cables, uh, exactly. Which and is what uh, we use it for. Exactly, uh, filters, um, SD cards, hard disks, so whatever you, you whatever you want. It. Here we have the set of uh, uh, our tough cases. So we're talking about hard cases, or most of the people call them flight cases, because uh, they're safe when it's time to travel. Uh, here at IBC, we are presenting uh, the little boy here. So the new tough 47. The numbers are used to uh, talk about the length of the um, of the tough cases. So basically, we got 55, at right. the moment three dimension. 47, 55, both, and 83, so the big, the big boy here. Um, so, uh, showing you around the product's range, basically, we got uh, one product that has been launched three years ago um, in uh, two different configurations. That was the low lead, so it means that this bag, basically, is a carry-on luggage, which is very important because it's pretty thin, okay? So this tough case comes with a proper handle here to transport when you're uh, when you got to move through the airport. It comes with basically two uh, latches, very important with a safer release system. So if you don't press the red button, the tough doesn't open. Okay, so this is very useful in case of accidental opening. For example, if you uh, I don't know run into something or. So you got four, uh, two metal pins to close it with the TSA locker rather than with the, your lockers. And you have two extra holes to add two more lockers. Okay, so in case you want to be super safe. <laughs> this is for sure certified to IP67, which means waterproof, dustproof, and it comes with the air pressure valve. For, okay. the, for the airplane. For the airplane, exactly. The cool thing about the internal version with the dividers is that, as a matter of fact, since we are working on scalability with the full Manfrotto ecosystem, basically the dividers comes with the tripod attachment system, which can be fastened on the top lid in order to transport your tripod together with the, your uh, tough case. The low lid version, so the version um, conceived as a carry-on luggage, comes with the foam as well. So you can decide whether to go for dividers. For example, if you got many cameras, many accessories, or if you have a big lens, rather than a foam if you, have a, if you want to have a dedicated custom internal for your uh, tough case. And you can cut it yourself. You can cut it yourself, exactly. The highlight version. So as you can immediately notice, we have a difference between the two leads, so basically this one is the low lead, this other one is the top, this, uh, this one is the high lead. So the main difference is the uh, dimension of the lead compartment. So it means that basically the two tough cases are conceived to store different type of gear. Because for example, here you can store higher gear with even the rig mounted. This version comes with the pre-cutted foam inside. The cool thing about this is that you can, thanks to the high lead, you can put your lenses vertically here. So you can save a lot of space and put a camera with the body, uh, with, um, with, a with a battery grip mounted yeah. in vertical. Or you can put your camera with the lens mounted. And the high lead allows for a great versatility and a lot of space, which is really needed. Um, all the rest and part of the feature are in common between yeah. all the tough. The cool thing about uh, this stuff is that here you can see one of our unique sets of accessories that are provided separately. 
Um, this is a unique patented system that we have in our range. Uh, all of our tough gear are equipped with these metal pins, which allows to fasten our set of accessories directly on the lid. The harness system, which is capable to transform the tough case into a backpack actually. So this is very useful, especially at the airport or if you're shooting on a location in outdoors, because if you can't roll it, you can transport it on your back. We got two more sets of accessories, uh, which are a laptop sleeve, so you can transform. For example, normally when you use tough cases, you got to bring your laptop uh, separately inside the backpack maybe. In this case, with the laptop compartment basically, you can store your laptop and iPad rather than your documents directly on the top, making it become a kind of a backpack. So basically you got all the, all the computers, your smartphone and an iPad uh, on the top lid. Uh, the third uh, accessory is a tripod bag that comes as well separately um, and basically it's capable to store all the range of Manfrotto Professional photo um, tripods and it's uh, attachable as well as all the other accessories to the outer part of the, um, of the lid. This is the smallest tough of the range. Uh, we are presenting it at IBC Trade Show. Um, we launched uh, this uh, tough case as a vertical expansion of the range in terms of price point, but we needed as well a smaller tough in order to bring with you smaller gear and smaller setups, such as, for example, a mirrorless setup with a battery grip mounted um, plus three lenses, rather than a foldable drone setup, rather than a laptop with the accessories or a action camera with all the related accessory, rather than um, a monitor, okay? This tough comes with all the same features that we already uh, showed of the other Tufts cases. So, safe and release system, the lockers here, the pressure valve, and uh, the metal pins. So, this stuff basically is capable of working together with the laptop sleeve and with the harness system. Um, this, this tough case comes with the pre-cubed foam inside. It means that it comes like this, and then you can cut yourself depending on uh, the needs that you have and with the uh, convoluted foam on the top lid in order to protect what you put inside. Thanks to this fit, all of our tough range basically are stackable or pileable, let me say together, and this is great because when it's time to move by van, you never know what will happen on the road. So basically it's great because you can stack all the tough up one on the other. Regardless of the tough that you buy of our range, you can pile them up so you can store Use a small one with a big exactly, one, and they exactly. will exactly. So you can store them up inside your car rather than inside your van, and you can drive fast to the location, uh, worry-free. Let me say, uh, so you can have a tidy organization and a safe organization. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much.